spear everyone up. Nice. Yeah, like, if you're going to, like, the digital stores on, like, any platform, really, like, there's just so many games, out, like, that are going to be coming out in the next couple of months. It's wild. I mean, it's great. Like, there has never been a better time to be playing video games. But, geez, it's a lot sometimes. I mean, technically, this would actually be a really good spot to farm XP. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? This would actually be a very good spot to farm XP. And I'd love to get the rest of these health gems. If you could give me this, that'd be great. Uh, more health, please. More health, please. <laughs> Alright, fine. I'll fight these guys without getting the health. You want to be like that game? I'll be like that. Ow. They really aren't giving me any more health? Okay. Alright, we'll just have to make sure we're fearing all these guys properly. Because we can get more mana. Okay, there's the health. There we go. Getting the mana seems to recharge faster. Get off, get off some fear. There's just a lot of these guys, jeez. Yeah, this is, this must be for just like a health upgrade or something, right? Seems like a lot of work for it though. Maybe it's armor, maybe it isn't that. All right, so are we getting our big boy now? I think so. Get out of the way. Don't let that... Ooh. Don't let that do that. That that smashy move is brutal. This does a lot of damage, though. Yeah, that is amazing. That's... Oh, hell yes. It's armor. Oh, that's great news. I was like, oh, please don't let this be for, like, a simple health upgrade. Because that would be very boring. All right, got her some mana. Excellent. Ooh, uh, what do we have here? Who gets the helmet? That looks like a Spyro helmet? Yeah, yeah. All right, so what does this do? Armor, Spyro. Oh, we have the full set here, too. Okay. Ah, the Fury Breath unlocked. Wait. Aha. So now we have the Fury Breath for him. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. Okay, that's pretty good. That might be worth the trade off for uh, that. Because what else does it get, Spyro? Let's actually see. Increase Fury Duration, increase Fury Power, and increase Chance to Combo. Okay, I mean, the Chance to Combo is kind of the downside, right? All right, cool. That's a, that is a very worthwhile piece of armor to get. Ooh, do we want to get more? Yeah, she needs a little. He needs a lot. So let's get him the rest of these crystals. Because that Fury Breath drains like no business. I know. That is a huge upgrade. I think this is where we fought that dude before. So not really worth going back here. Yeah, we already fought that guy here. Okay. So what else can we do around here? Assuming this is the way to go, because that's when the wall popped up. Ooh. Definitely want to get some health for dinner. Good. Good. Just making sure we're not leaving any upgrades behind around here. I don't think so. We've been pretty diligent. Ooh. There's a tunnel up here. 
Wait, what is this camera doing? What is this camera doing? There's definitely a tunnel up here, though. Hmm. Yeah, the... I wonder if we have to come from it through a, the, another way. Because, yeah, look, like, in the distance, you can see that there's definitely a tunnel up there that you can fly through. All right, let's go over there. Oop. Okay, so we have to go around the forest. What else we got over here? Yeah, it looks like it's from up here. Yeah, it looks like some route up here leads us to that. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder if that's later. Yeah, I wonder if we have, if we have to come back through there. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look like... Whoop, sorry, Cinder. Yeah, I'm not seeing any way to get up to there. Ooh, there is a little way through here. Oop, no, there is not. <laughs> Sometimes the, the level is a little deceptive. Like, I feel like they should have just made that like a full wall. Like, why make an invisible wall when you already have wall walls? Yeah, maybe that path becomes accessible later. We'll see. But we do have at least one true way forward, so let's go. At least I thought we did. It looks like... No. Yeah, like, look, like, that over there definitely looks like a pathway. Are we going down? Ooh. Uh, no, we're not going down. Hmm. Where do we want to go? I definitely thought it was going to be this way, if only because this is where the invisible... Whoa, the invisible walls were popping up. And again, the camera being weird here is very strange. Okay, this is weird. We have to go opposite the camera. <laughs> oh, I wonder if that's a loading trick. Yeah, I wonder if they're purposely trying to hide, like, the occlude the level. The level. All right. Yeah, you have to actually go against the camera, which is kind of funny. But I think I think it's just to hide the fact that they're transitioning between the two. Hmm. All right. Let's see how much, how quickly we can take this guy out with this move. Because this thing does serious damage. Yeah, look at that. We got a hundred, 110 hit combo. Holy jeez. Okay, so that went pretty quick. Yeah, so if Cinder has full mana, it's not too hard. <laughs> I guess now we can also check out... Ooh, we could have tried out the Fury Breath, too. Oh, that is a very good secondary elemental attack. Yeah, I'm kind of interested just to see... How much damage does this thing do? Oh, jeez. Uh, it hits real quick. Oh, and we used up all of our mana doing that. Well, that's not good. All right, let's get Spyro some mana and try that again on the big guy. Ooh, closer than I would have liked. Oh, come on. There we go. Ooh. There we go. Oh, come on. Do not fall off. Ooh, that hits hard. Yeah, Spyro's Fury attack built up real fast like that. Unfortunately, he uses a mana so fast. I don't know if it's worth it compared to like the health regen and stuff. Cause yeah, it's it's a lot of mana to get that off, even for like just a couple seconds. I mean, thankfully, Cinder's at least doing a little work. 
Like that's just a few seconds of it. I wonder if there's, hmm, I wonder if there's a way to get, I don't know, like a buff to it? I don't know. Doesn't seem worth it. Ooh, wait a second. Why doesn't she have any mana? Oh, we definitely need this health. There's a lot of guys up here who would love to chew through these poor little dragons. Yeah, it's tough to tell how much damage it does because it hasn't killed it. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. I'm waiting. I wonder if this also, like, does the fury breath also stack with, like, the melee? Like, is that doing more damage during the melee as well? Ooh, we should probably switch to Cinder. Yeah, we got a big boy. We got a big boy. Uh, Cinder, you want to come up here? You want to? You want to come up here? Wait, why is it? Oh, oh, that's what's doing it. Gotcha. Okay. So, it, there's a purple crystal below here that's draining. It. Gotcha. Okay. That's what the whispering sound is. I'm like, what is that sound effect? Yeah, it's draining the mana, but that's fine. I'd rather get the health for them. And then charge up the, the... Yeah, there we go. The only downside is without his... Hmm, I don't know. I don't know if the trade-off is worth it. Like, the trade-off between, like, having Spyro have health regeneration in the background? I don't know. Oh, yeah, we definitely need to break the crystal. It's just it's below us. So, what is this? Increased defense? No, it's not even this one. It's this right now. Where is it? Yeah, we're generating health. Yeah, I don't know. This seems like the, the better overall combo, but we'll see. We might miss the Fury Breath. We'll see. Yeah, the, the, the crystal is right there, it looks like. Ooh, that was close. Closer than I would have liked. So I wonder if these guys are just gonna keep respawning until we take that thing out. There we go. All right, there's armor there. There we go. Nice. I want to get her man all the way up because her poison ability is so good. I'm just going to wait for this guy. We're going to bait out his attack. Come on. There we go. 30 hit combo. It just did so good. Look at this. It's like ridiculous. Yeah, he's dead. Just like that. That is wild. And just like that, he's gone. Yeah, that regenerating health on Spyro is nice because he cannot take damage while we're not controlling him. So basically, all we have to do is switch off of him whenever he's low on health and he'll just regenerate. Like, no problem. Like, no problem. He takes a pet. You know, that's a good dragon. You can tell, no fear. Takes a pet like no problem. Great, now let's get this armor and get the hell out of here. <laughs> Come on, buddy. All right, who's this for? I'm assuming Cinder. Hell yeah. Get that armor. Excellent, all right. So what does that armor get? Ooh. Nope, don't want you, I want you. Okay, that was the tail here, right? Ooh, Fury Duration versus Attack Speed. No, I think the Attack Speed on... Yeah, yeah, I think this is the right combo so far. We still need two more items of armor for her, though. I think we missed them, though. I think, I think they're in some other level. Okay, ooh, now that we took care of that, 
That little detour of madness. Ooh, power up crystal up here. I see that game. I see that. All right, so how do we get to this? It's quite high up. Hmm. You know, we should probably heal our, our dragons. Oh, yeah, I am... Oh, I mean, we could XP farm that place without too much problem. Thankfully, Cinder's, like... I feel like Cinder's secondary poison attack is maybe a little too powerful. Good. Great. Everyone's nice and full. You love to see it. Oops, come on. Yeah, how do we get up here? Hmm. Yeah, there's definitely the magic upgrade up there. Hmm. I'm trying to see, is there like a higher point that we need to fall from? Obviously, we need to climb this. That's like our main objective. Goes up to the safe point and all that. Oh, there's definitely also a magic upgrade over here. Oh my, oh my. I mean, I'm not gonna turn that down. So there's two of them in this small little area here. All right, Spyro now his, has his next mana upgrade as well. Yeah, look right up here. Oop, come on, not trying to get into the fire. Yeah, I wonder if there's a, mm, I wonder if there's a way to cheese it. Yeah, it's, hmm. I'm not seeing a clear way to get up here. Hold on. Is there anything that we can climb? That well, doesn't look like it. Nothing up here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Not seeing how we're gonna get up to the there. Because, yeah, when we fly close to the wall, it actually brings us lower. Hmm. Okay. Well, we have some friends that we need to take care of. Oh, come on. Don't die. Don't die. <laughs> there we go. Eat it. There we go. Good stuff. You know, I think we can get her next upgrade, too. Oh, that secondary poison attack is just so satisfying. And when you get, when you get all of the hits, oh. Yeah, we are getting a lot of XP. All right, well, let's knock this over first. See what this gets us. I'm assuming this is gonna let us climb up that wall. And come on, little guys. You can do it. There you go. Okay, so what is this? Does this change anything else about the environment other than this climbing wall being more accessible? No, it doesn't look like it. Well, why don't we upgrade I think we said it was the, was it the shadow? Yeah, the shadow. We should be able to get the upgrade here for her. Can we close though? Hell yeah. Okay, so we need to now upgrade the wind and she will be fully upgraded. What about Spyro? How are you doing, buddy? All right, that's fully upgraded. Oh, that is like no upgrades. Okay. Well, I guess why don't we level up these while we're here. All right. And we'll get this one as well. It'll be pretty close. Yeah, we're not quite there. We're about a thousand away on Spyro. So if we run into any elite enemies, we'll try to get him the upgrades as well. Ooh, why don't we switch over to him just because he has more health in <laughs> Whoop. 
Dragon, Dragon Age Inquisition is one of those interesting games where it, you can bounce off of it so easily that you may enjoy it, but because the game kind of doesn't always meet you on it, like, let's say the nicest of terms, especially in the early area. Hell yeah. Hey, KD, how are you doing today? Yeah, no, I, I have, I have heard that, uh, that folklore before. That, that's a fun one. Nice, disarm these guys. Ooh, that's not a fun way to go. I think, I think you know the the concept of like the, you know, your your current life telling you how you, you may have died in a previous one is always fun. Cause it always leads up to like interesting like mysteries too. You know, in fiction at least. And come on, let's get this guy. Hell yeah, that's the launch I wanted. Exactly, exactly. Like, that's the fun part of, like, you know, the idea that, like, you can determine that stuff is that, you know, you can make up the most scandalous, fun version of that story. Like, you know, maybe maybe you were, like, a, a, like a rum smuggler. And, you know, in, in during a heist, it all went wrong. All right, let's switch back over to fire. Ooh. Oh, wow. It's a hell of a view. Oh, what? Whatever that is. Oh, that's the destroyer. Oh. Oh, hell yeah. We're taking you down. All right. Why don't we switch over to Dinder? Yeah. You love that secondary poison attack. It's so satisfying. Nice. This is an ominous, like, port. Like, this is like in Dead Space where, you know, it starts giving you, like, you know, med kits, air canisters, ammo, and you're like, huh. That's strangely generous of you, game. Why are you giving me all of these lovely healing and, and enhancement items? Hmm? Weird. Oh, and all this XP just sitting here. Yeah, that's got to be the, the... the. I think that's the destroyer. It looks like the destroyer that at least we partly destroyed. <laughs> you know, it's a semi-destroyed destroyer. Oh. What do we have here? We have ourselves a little combat arena, methinks. Yep. Yeah, that's right, game. I saw that coming. <laughs> oh, these assholes. That's fine. That's fine. Ooh. The nice part about this is that we can theoretically maybe hit both of them at the same time. Ooh, we're getting a little low. God, we're getting so many hits. All right, that's one. I'll take it over from here. Spyro needs that health, though. There we go. Nice. Ooh, those hits. Got to be careful. Nice. Okay. Come on. All right, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. Thankfully, we were able to use Cinder's poison ability early on in the fight. That thing does so much damage. Nice. 
Nice, go for the dodge. Hit him in the back. There we go. Nice. Hell yeah. Ooh. Hey, do you know what? I won't turn down this XP. Oh, wow. They're really just dumping XP on us right now. I guess it's one of those like, hey, this is your last chance to really level up. Uh, we should get Anna on Cinder. We really want her to have her poison ability available whenever we need it. That thing does such good work for us. All right. And more XP. Nice. Yeah, I will say in this game, I have never felt so far any of the combat encounters have felt unfair in the way they did near the end of the second game. Like, there were a couple, like, arenas near the end that felt truly merciless in uh, their execution. Oh, hell yes. We're coming for you, buddy. Steiner Gallery. Okay, cool. I'll take that. I'll take all the unlocks. Anything. All right. Oh, okay. So it's we've cleared cleared the smoke. The tower. It must lead to Malifor's lair. Thanks I mean, for ruining the moment. I mean, that makes sense. All right, Malifor. Okay, so we need to get it lit, is what is what the game is telling us. 